Electronics N857 Ec1 Pro X Premium Gaming Laptop Review Deal Discount Unboxing Setup This laptop and this company honestly deserve more recognition on the internet than any of the more well-known companies. They put the customers and the quality of the products they provide ahead of all else. Even with large-scale production, I cannot imagine that a laptop of these specs could be assembled for a reasonably cheaper price, solely considering the cost of the high-quality components that went into it. You can read the specifications and the pros and cons of the laptop as described by other reviewers, but keep in mind that for just over $1,000. The laptop isn't going to be made of an ultra-lightweight platinum and titanium alloy. The design is efficient and I'm also rather elegant. My previous dollar $6000 plus Alienware was of poorer construction and performance than this lightweight gaming computer. I've never taken the time to review anything before, but I felt this was a more than worthy product. I hope it stays that way, and that the company maintains its values. I'll update this review if anything changes. I am a former software developer and now do a lot of photography and video editing, which is why this laptop was appealing to me. I do not do much gaming so I can't provide as much insight in that realm. I have owned and used many other brands of laptops over the years from Compaq, HP, Dell, Toshiba, and Lenovo. This is the only brand of laptop I found that has too many display port connectors and an HDMI video connector which was exactly what I needed to hook up my two external monitors and big screen HDTV. I know that the new USB-C connector could also support a fourth external display but I don't have a monitor that supports that yet, there is probably some sort of adapter that I could find. I have the 1080p mass screen which is really bright and sharp too for when I am using standalone. 4 USB ports, 1 USB-C, 2 USB-3, 1 USB-2, allow me to hook up all my external hard drives and other peripherals like, USB Blu-ray drive, scanner, etc. The only external port that my last laptop had that this does not is eSATA which some of my external drives supported. The backlighted keyboard has a nice feel and I like being able to change the color or turn the lighting off completely. The touchpad is very responsive and better than some of my previous laptops and there is plenty of palm rest space. I also use a wireless Logitech TK820 with it and go between the two easily when I am traveling. My last laptop did not have a numeric keypad and it is really nice to have that back. I also like the placement of the arrow keys and the function keys are clearly labeled. It doesn't look like the labeling will wear off like some of my previous laptops. The weight is less than my previous laptop, Lenovo W520, and the power supply, aka brick, is much smaller too which lightens my load when traveling. I like that the power connector is on the left side of the laptop instead of on the back. With other models I have had power connector problems caused by the stress of the laptop tilting back and cracking the connector. In fact there are no connectors on the back of this laptop, they are all on the left or right side. I think this is a good design. I understand some complaining about the air exhaust on the right side, but since I either use the built-in keyboard and trackpad or an external keyboard with trackpad it is not a factor for me. I also have it in a laptop cart or on a lap board so I have not had a problem with air circulation. The fan will rev up when the CPU and graphics go processor really kicks in but I don't find it that loud or annoying. I think it looks very stylish with the backlighted logo emblem on the front. My only complaint is that the case lid is shiny and picks up oily finger marks easily. Bottom line, this is a very fast and capable laptop for a price that very hard to beat. I know many people will not be familiar with the brand and neither was I until I saw it here on Amazon and read reviews for their other models. I have had a couple of occasions so far to email them with support questions and their responses were fast and they directly answered my questions. It is still a fairly new laptop for me and I will update if I run into any issues but I since it is a new model, I wanted to get my review out there for others who may be considering it. Special discounts on product. Get the discount link in the description box.